Brewers regular season games 96 through 103. Brewers will lose 6 to 5 against the Nationals on July 13th. The only main highlight I could find was a Luis Garcia Jr. home run, his 11th of the year. July 14th, the Brewers would win 93 against the Nationals. Also, I got to meet Devin Williams that day. Willie Domus will get his 23rd double on the year with an RBI. William Contreras' 11th home run of the year would make it 2 to 1. Ah, yes, and the finally acquainted Garrett Mitchell will get his first home run of 2024. Willie Adams would hit home run number 15, making it 9-3. So the All-Star game happened. There was two Brewers, William Contreras and Christian Yelich. Total, they went over 4. In Game 98, the Brewers would win 8-4 in 12 innings against the Twins. Carlos Santana would homer out to right, making it his 14th of the year, tying it up with 3. Jackson Shuria would hit an RBI single, making it 5-3. William Contreras would make it 8-3, to and Diego A. Castillo would make it 8-4. to The Brewers would win 8-7 to in Game 2 against the Twins. Eric Haas would hit home run number 2 as a Brewer, making it 1-2. to Byron Buxton would reach double-digit home runs, making it 3-1. to Jackson Churio would hit a 2-RBI double, making it 3-3. to Trevor Larnick would hit home run number 10, making it 5-4. to Jackson Churio would also hit home run number 10, tying it up at 5. After the reviewed home run, Reese Hoskins would hit home run number 15, making it 7-5. Eric Haas would hit home run number 3, making it a two-homer game, making it 8-5. Byron Buxton's 11th home run of the year would make it 8-6. Brooks Lee would score the final run of the game on a ground out. The Brewers would lose game 1 against the Cubs, 3-1. Ian Happ's home run would make it 3-0, being his 16th of the year. Willie Adams would also hit his 16th of the year, making it 3-1. The Brewers would take Game 2 a whole one to nothing. The only run the Brewers would score was being Bryce Trang RBI single in the 8th. The Brewers would take Game 3, 3 to 2. Seiya Suzuki would hit home run number 14, making it 2 to 1. William Contreras would hit double number 25, making it 3 to 2. And the final game of the recap, Game 1 versus the Marlins, they would lose 6 to 2. How could you lose to the Marlins? Anyways, Brian De La Cruz would hit home run number 18, making it 2 to nothing. Jake Berger will make it 3 to nothing. Reese Hoskins will hit home run number 16, making it 5 to 1. And finally, Josh Bell will hit home run number 13, making it 6 to 2. The Brewers are now 59 and 44, and the Brewers' respective Brewers player of two weeks, Reese Hoskins, because why not?